So are you all excited and rubbing your hands eagerly to get hold of Node.js? You don't need to wait for too long. Let's just head over to Node.js.org and get hold of Node.js. In your browser, head over to Node.js.org. And as you browse down, you see the download buttons for Node.js for your specific platform. In this case, it shows the download buttons for Mac OS. So click on the current version of Node.js. Click on that to download the installer package for your platform. Once you get hold of the installer package, double click on it to start installing Node.js. Depending on your operating system, you will see a window like this on your computer and just follow along the instructions to install Node.js on your machine. You may need administrative privileges to install Node.js on your machine. So make sure that you are logged in into an administrator account and install Node.js to be accessible by all users that are logged in on the computer. And once the installation is complete, let's go ahead and verify that Node.js has been installed correctly. Open up a terminal window or a command window and add the prompt type node minus v to check the version of node installed. Similarly, check npm minus v to check the version of npm installed. I am starting with these versions of node and npm and the subsequent exercises will be based on these. Even if you install a later version, I'm, I'm pretty sure that they, it would be backward compatible, so all the steps should work pretty much the same. With this, we complete installation of Node.js. So let's go ahead and make use of Node.js in the next exercise. <music>